So I just competed in my very first meet and it was awesome. Let's do a quick recap of the meet. So honestly, the meet was incredible. I was able to break the state record for squat in the 75 kg class, squatted 523 pounds. I was also able to win my weight class and win the best lifter in the men's open division. Such a privilege to compete and go hard. So on meet day, I felt really, really good, which was a little surprising because that whole week before that, I lost 15 pounds. I started the week at 179 pounds and then ended in weighing in, I guess it was a little more than 15 pounds, weighed in at 163 pounds on weigh-ins because I did a water cut and that sucked. That I do not recommend doing. But that's what I ended up doing. So I was riding the bike, uh, what, a half an hour to an hour at a time, trying to shed all the water weight after drinking two gallons a day for a couple days. Um, weighed in, and then right after weighing, man, I just pounded everything I could eat. I had Sour Patch Kids, I had Swedish Fish, I had Pringles, I had Subway, whatever carbs I could get in my body, that's what I consumed. Had a couple Gatorades, and uh, probably about two gallons of water that day, because I just had to re, re, re-energize, and replenish all the stuff that left my body, uh, so I could perform on meat day. But suffice this, <laughs> suffice this, little bit. Suffice it to say, meet day went crazy. <clears throat> so my coach, he came and he helped me out. He's been helping me program this entire uh, prep and was there to walk me through meet day as well as a bunch of guys from Kabuki Strength. Uh, B more, shout them out, huge help the whole time at the meet. <clears throat> but let's run down kind of what happened. For my squat attempts, I did 462 pounds for my first attempt and it went really, really well. Basically, a guaranteed opener. That's something I can hit for like four reps on my worst day, honestly. So it's nailed that. Then came in, hit 5.07 for my second attempt, which is a little bit sketchy because the rack height, I didn't set as low as I needed it to be. Um, I think I needed one notch lower. So like, I kind of did a G on my way out, but hit the rep pretty nice. I even smiled just like, Halfway through the rep coming down, I knew this was gonna be a piece of cake. And then I hit then I hit the state record 523 for my third attempt. And again, I smiled through this one. It was just going so, so well. Um, all the taper, all the work showed perfectly on the platform, so I was able to smash that. And then I had the option to go for a fourth attempt since I broke uh, the squat record on my third attempt. And me being stupid, I decided to do it. Um, <laughs> and that was not a good decision. Uh, I should have just saved every ounce that I had for the rest of the meet, which I kind of ended up doing because I had that last attempt loaded up. I don't even know how much it was. Um, and like halfway down, I was like, this isn't going to happen. So I just kind of let the spotter take it. Just kind of gave up. I was like, nope. I'll let them take it so I didn't spend the energy that I needed for the rest of the meet. Then went into our bench. So my first attempt was 280 pounds, smoked it. 310 pounds, I think was the second one, smoked that one. I absolutely nailed uh, 330. Really, bench just was crazy that day. I think I could have gotten another 10 pounds on it, but really grateful for my coach hitting, hitting the attempt selection right at the point where I have so much confidence um, going into my next meets because I really want to compete again. And then going to my deadlifts, same story. Opener, amazing. Second attempt, flew. And third attempt, even. Uh, my coach didn't tell me. Lucas did not tell me how much I was going to be lifting. And I just sent it, man. And that was a weight that I'd actually missed. Um, the week before, but absolutely destroyed this time. And really think I have some more juice in. So overall, the meat just was, was amazing. And I'm so grateful for the ability that I had to prepare and go hard uh, and work with some great people. I met some really, really awesome people throughout the meet, competed against some good people. And I'm just stoked to hopefully compete again soon. Obviously my baby is coming any day now. Um, so I'm thinking about competing again in the fall. In the fall. I'm going to keep on going, keep on pushing, get even stronger. Let's keep making some gains. <laughs>